Hello, this is Ariana Antonio for MDF31408, and this is my week four project review. Uh, so this week, I'll show you the code. We went ahead and created an app that uh, inflated a web view um, that was loaded with HTML that we created um, as opposed to just a static web page. Um, so here we've got our main activity, um, inflating the web view um, from the with our HTML that I created. Um, and here's the HTML. It's really simple. Just creates basically a form um, and implements some jQuery. Um, and then the form uses uh, JavaScript to get the values that were inputted into the form. Uh, and here it sends it to Android and then clears it out. And then back over here is where it accepts the data that was sent over and then it creates an intent to send an email. Um, so I will go ahead and launch this and show it off. So here's the app. Um, I used a, a jQuery custom theme for the coloring and stuff. I mean, it's, you know, pretty simple, just background colors, but it would obviously look a little bit more different um, if there were drop downs and that sort of thing. But um, but it is a custom jQuery, like a theme roller theme. Uh, we can go ahead and enter an email address. Um, and birthday. And then some text. And this is to sign up for a newsletter. So these use the same icons as well as this is a, an image button um, and it's just going to generate an email. Uh, so this is the intent. Uh, it's sp specifically right here where it does the um, message. Um, that basically means that it only gives the option for emails uh, so it won't pull up like text message or any of that sort of thing. Uh, and here you can go ahead if you want to pick a different one to send it from. So you can see that it put the email address that I put in, uh, my name, my the birth date I put in, and the comment. And then you can go ahead and click send. And it sends it and clears that out. And then if we go ahead and open up email. Uh... There we go. And there is the email. Um, so there's that. All right, so theme and uh, user interface are pretty similar. Um, you know, like I said, in terms of the theme, I did use a theme roller custom theme from jQuery uh, for the colors and um, uh, an image button as well. And uh, let's see the web view. Um, obviously it's got the forms in it and then I showed you the JavaScript and you could see that it was obviously getting passed, um, is collecting the data and passing it to the native Android code and then the native Android code is taking it and, um, launching the intent for email. Um, and there is, you know, a function in there so that if, um, the only real required field is email, uh, you know, it would just be say hello blank you know if I didn't have my name in there but obviously you can't send an email without an email address so if that's empty uh, it won't do any of this and it will prompt for the email address um, so oh and in terms of most challenging this week uh, I mean it was a little challenging in terms of creating the HTML and the JavaScript partially because I haven't worked with them in many many months since the web block basically uh, and also it was kind of hard to um, debug uh, since this is all you know built for Java, so if one of these wasn't working it properly, it, you know there wasn't a really good way for it to tell me what was going on. But um, but otherwise, it was a relatively simple week. Um, actually, very little code for that. Um, so that's it. Thanks so much.